OK, joined by Desi Farrell. Desi, some game of football, obviously disappointing to miss out in the end, but a brilliant game nonetheless. Yeah, obviously we're disappointed with the result. Um, uh, probably disappointed with how we played for periods of that game. We, we were flat and lethargic um, in, in certain sections of that game, but um, you know, happy with the character lads showed in, at the end of the game to get back into it, and then again in extra time as well. So um, that, that's definitely a positive. And just generally the experience for the lads then in terms of uh, a lot of newcomers out there, a lot of fellas that have, haven't played in um, national um, final before, um, and a lot of them obviously never experienced in extra time and then the penalty shootout, you know. So uh, th there's definitely a lot to take for us uh, fr from today's game, and we're, we're happy with that component of it. And I said obviously during the week, you obviously wanted to win this game as the league final, you obviously wanted to win it, but one thing you were looking for this week was a highly competitive game, and you got that to set today. Yeah, yeah, and we knew we were going to get that. Um, there was plenty of shadow boxing throughout the league campaign, you know, I think our, our last couple of victories, we played teams that were very depleted, uh, either resting players or uh, players unavailable through injury or you know so, so the last game was even a dead rubber dead rubber for the opposition so it, it was it was difficult to truly assess where you were at we knew the narrative that developed around the team in the media or it's sort of externally in, in the public domain it wasn't a true reflection of what was going on and where things were at um, and we knew we'd get the examination today and uh, ultimately uh, we we now know where we're truly at and uh, where the campaign has gone well and you know we, we've seen progress throughout uh, we have a huge amount of work to do to again get after uh, important aspects of our performance yeah, and it's a quick turnaround into the Leinster Championship two weeks until we face either Longford or Meath in the Leinster uh, quarter final so I guess the full focus is on that now yeah um, obviously we will review that game try and take what we can from it um, we're going to give the lads some time off now for a couple of days and uh, regroup then at the the end of the week, and um, you know, start planning uh, for a big, big first round in Leinster.